Hi everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Akbin. Everyone knows this week, you know, there was a DV uh, lottery actually. The results were out and all the applicants were able to start checking them online or through the, you know, State Department website. But we did actually receive some questions this week actually from our followers. What's the process is going to be if we win the actually uh, the lottery? This is briefly what I could tell you is once, you know, you check the actually the status of your the uh, application that you file for a green card through your reference number through the website of State Department. And if you see that you actually won the lottery, then what's going to happen is you're going to need to fill up the form DS-260 and, and file it. And then wait after until October and then see if they will be able to reach out to the numbers of you know your case which you know every applicant is going to have some numbers and and what's important that the current the visa bulletin will this to show that actually your case is ready to be you know seen by the consulate and then you're going to actually get the appointment through the US consulate in your country once you go to that immigrant visa appointment and then you will actually be granted to visa uh, hopefully if everything goes well and then all you have to do enter the US as soon as you enter the US you will receive the green card at your address so that's the one part right and the other part of the or questions that we received from our followers were they were asking so how can we maintain this green card now you know we got it we won we got it through the, the visa to the consul came to the US and we got the green card and usually the applicants who are asking us this because they have their responsibility still back their home right they're either working or they have an education or family issues that they cannot leave right away or before they move here they need to you know close some stuff there up and then take care of some issues and come here what I usually recommend is if you think that's going to take longer time for you to come to US definitely file the re-entry permit while you're in the US and then that's going to give you you know possibility to stay outside the US after two years so that way you can take care of your things that you had to take care of before you permanently move to the US or secondly if you just need some time to clear those up then make sure that you don't stay outside the US more than six months and you can travel back and forth that way you can settle in the US you know before you start having problems at the entries. <music>